Hey y'all, so right now I'm out at Target shopping to find something to surprise my husband with. So this is what I came up with so far. Um, since we of course don't know the gender, I tried to find something gender neutral. I already looked at Walmart. Can't really find anything. So this is what I found. Um, the box, it says happy birthday. I'm gonna tell them don't pay any attention to that, but at the end I'll just say, it's saying happy birthday to our baby in the future. And I'm gonna open it. And there, I'll have it. Have that. Then you'll take that out. And it'll say, welcome to the world. Um, and then I'll probably put the test under that. That's what I'm thinking so far. So we'll see. Um, this is the other thing I had, the other outfit. It just says hi though. So I like the words on this one better. This is the front. Yeah. This is the back. Well, the onesie. Hello. So, yeah. I'm here and that's pretty much all they got. That's gender neutral. That's decent enough with a message on it. So, just wanted to update y'all. Bye. I'm going to um, try to surprise him with a picture photo shoot. So I was driving around today looking for a location to shoot the pictures because of the vision I have to do it. So hopefully everything goes right. Tomorrow is the day I officially take my test. So we will see. All right. Oh, this is cute. It says peace and thank you. My baby probably is a little pee right now. I'm technically three weeks and six days today. Because today is November, probably like the, I don't know, it's a few days after election. But that's all, guys. Bye. Hey, so now I'm at a garden side or park, whatever you want to call it, in Rock Hill. And I'm just looking for a location to shoot our pictures for my vision. It is so pretty out here. It's called Grenadian Garden or something. Yeah, those turtles right there are clearly real. Uh, I can't zoom in on the video. I thought they were fake, but then they started moving their head. But this is probably where I'm going to be doing the shoot at. Um, just because it is really so pretty. So, that's all. Bye. So, I have baby shoes under there. The box is here right there. Under the baby shoes is the test. Then I put this on the top. And then I'm gonna kind of put this on here. So I just told my husband that we're expecting. Tell him how you feel for real. Great. 
after how many years? Too long. Do you know actually how many? You keep saying three. Yeah, a little bit over three. We're right at three. But yeah, we're finally expecting, so keep us in y'all's prayers as things are going on. I found out for sure this morning, well, I mean, okay, I found out um, on Wednesday, election night, the day of election, no, the day after. November the 4th is when I found out, so I found out on Wednesday, uh, maybe. It, well, and well then, I'm confused on it. If you find out on Wednesday, what was the purpose and you keep telling me that you was testing just to tell me? Oh, because I didn't want you to... Well, I mean, I, it was negative. I'm, I'm telling you I wasn't lying. I tested more than once. Mm -hmm. I, okay, wait. Let me tell you the timeline. So on the two days, like a dummy, two days after, I thought maybe it was going to be positive because IVF, I didn't know how early you could get a positive. So I did it two days after, and it was negative. Then I did it three days after, and I said, because I, I said I wasn't going to do it no more two days. But I did it on the third day, too. It was negative. And then I did it on the fifth day. And I did it with the little cheap one, you know, those little stick things, the little skinny things out of the package. I did that one on the on the fifth day after after the procedure on Wednesday. I did it, and that was negative. And so I was like, "Oh, this is bad," because I'm already I should be seeing something by now, which I felt like I should have, but it was negative. So I was like, "Well, let me just do the first response." After I kept telling myself that to take no more but I got anxious I didn't get anxious I just wanted to know so I took the first response one because the clinical guard one gave me a negative so I took the actual real stick the big one and it gave me two lines it was light it was faint but it wasn't faint to where I had to squint my eyes or nothing like it was two lines I was like okay well, this is good so I'm going to actually do what I'm supposed to do and wait till Sunday so I waited till this morning once she went downstairs. I couldn't sleep this morning. Did you hear me up all morning kind of after the shot? Because I was just ready. And I so took you it. went back and did exactly what we said we wasn't going to do. Still. We, I clearly told you to wait till uh, after oh, the Oh, well, no, go. no. I, I understand. I had, to, I, I had to say that to you because the purpose of this photo shoot is a pregnancy reveal photo shoot to my husband. That's the reason. It's Fall pictures, yes, family pictures, but the reason for the photo shoot was to reveal my pregnancy because after I got the positive on Wednesday, I was actually happy and I had faith that it was going to stay positive and everything was going to work out. So I told you, yeah, we're not going to take it to after the photo shoot because I didn't want you asking me to take it in the morning. And no one in my head already took it. So that's why, because the actual purpose, like I already had told the photographer everything. I'm surprised you were suspicious. We kept whispering, but yeah, because I was ready to go. I know. But didn't it turn out great? Yeah. Other than the box dropping, like it was set up so perfectly. I will show you the setup because I recorded it. But we are mommy and poppy to be y'all. So watch out, sweet baby Ray, coming 2021. It's <laughs> cutting time. No, it's not. It's loving, spoiling my baby time. Yep. Followed up with ass cut. Am I missing anything? No. So, yeah, I'll upload the video, but Don't the box yet. was told. No. I make my videos in advance. But, yeah, I'm going to upload a video of how the box was supposed to look. I mean, it was so pretty. I'll show you how it looked. But that's all. We're home.